Alright Lawrence, Thomas, Leia and Dennis. And today we're gonna do some scoring from the baseline. Baseline! Scoring from the baseline? No, you're not. You're on the safe one. Is that the baseline challenge? No. No. Well that's the same, right? Good yeah. That's the same. That are all those games that I won, alright? Yeah, did you know? Yeah. Did you know that if you subscribe to a YouTube channel, that Santa Claus will send you an extra gift what? one year? Yeah. 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 And also, if you like us on uh, Facebook and if you uh, follow us on Instagram, and by the way, TikTok. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Let's start. Let's, let's start. start. Let's start. There are three ways. Three. Three and probably a bit more, of course, but there are three basic ways where you can score from the baseline. Okay, come, come. Is this again so such a situation you should only do when you're in front with 10 goals? Or uh, there is one, there is one. <laughs> there is one. Okay, so to start off with, most goalies, yeah, when a attacker is entering from this side of the baseline, is covering the first post. Do you agree, Dennis? Yeah, yeah, yeah. definitely. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So there are a few things. Yeah, so first one will be entering from on the baseline, yeah, get the ball to the inside. It's gonna and be a killer around. again. Yeah. <laughs> I'm well protected. It's gonna be a killer again. <laughs> yeah, so again, go from here, get the goalie out, back and sweep into the long corner. Ah. Long here, the long corner. Yeah. Okay. yeah, this is the second way. So Dennis is not a smart goalie, yeah? So we do the same move, we pull the ball to the left. Dennis is moving, moving again, yeah? Oh. And get it back. Oh. So get the goalie moving, move it back, pa! You have to wait then. You have to wait. Yeah. Yeah? Be patient and watch the goalie. Third way, do yeah? I need my helmet? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> know what you gotta do. <laughs> so we actually have four. We you know your skills. Yeah? <laughs> so, <laughs> way number three. Uh, it's a difficult one, eh? And it's only if you're not enough options, there are defenders everywhere, yeah, boom. Yeah? So, and I just need to score. So I'm gonna try to aim to push the ball here, in the area, there's the helmet, and the crossbar. Like, impossible. It's, it's impossible. If you do it, you're a freaking hero. Dennis, you ready? Yeah, I won't move. Okay. Here's Up. a little gap. So. <laughs> there. It's quite tough. Let's <laughs> we'll try it again in the exercise as well. Okay, this is the three? And there's one more, there's oh, one more. This is one, this is one crazy, it's crazy, eh? It's crazy, man. Crazy, crazy. Yeah? So, to it maybe... It suits you. It's crazy. It suits you. Yes. So, uh, it's an indoor move as well. And there's one guy from Amsterdam, Robert Tigges, eh? It's a signature move. Yeah? So, to move the ball, again, like in the second one, to this side. So, then it's moving, get the ball under, and get it from there. We're, we're doing a circus today. Circus! Circus! Okay, shall we try a few? Yeah, let's try it. We're gonna try out number one. <laughs> okay, let's try out number dos. Dos. Dos serve a uh, uh, ballos, pelotas. Vale. Okay, let's try out number three. 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 Senor. Senor. Okay, let's try it number four. Try it, try it, try it number four.
it's a tip to uh, it's a really good tip to try this like a hundred times before you do it in a match because otherwise you get these incidents on national television of course now and then you get these kind of things on, te on television <laughs> or just on YouTube <laughs> don't, okay. don't try this at home <laughs> Let's do some uh, random ones. Random. And, um, actually, our cameraman gave us a very good tip. Yeah, when you do a move, so either one, two, three, or four, yeah, it's quite important that you accelerate in whatever you're doing. So I can move the ball to the left on a really slow pace, and then, yeah, you can also be like, pa pa, and that's what you want, right, Mao? May yes. I say one thing from a goalie point of view? Yeah, okay then. Now I stay in the goal. Uh, but normally a lot of goalies rush out when you go close to that marker over there. Mm -hmm. So know that you cannot go too close to the goalie to make your move. Because uh, then they will just boom, surprise you and get the ball. Surprise. Huh? Yeah, good. Right. That's a winner. My personal favorite. My oh. personal favorite is number three. Yes, eh? It's nice, eh? It's very nice. nice. My uh, personal favorite is number four because it's always good to laugh together, huh? <laughs> <laughs> they all enjoyed it. So that's, that's it's that's fine. That's Everyone fine. enjoyed it. What's your favorite? My personal favorite. I think when you pull it back, so go inside, pull it back, that's my least favorite. Nah, like, uh, that's a hard one for a goalie. Yeah, like it. Nah, I just uh, score always, so it's. Uh... <laughs> no, just kidding. Um, try this out at your uh, training session. Make sure your goalie knows uh, what to do. Um, or, not. or not. Or not. Or not. score. <laughs> um, and then take the goalie in the match. Yes. Hey, but thank you for watching. Hopefully, you like this video. See you next week and uh, goodbye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Next week. Bye bye.